Alright. Fuck? Hey. Welcome back to another fucking week of the Small Member Squad podcast. You already know, it's another scuffed one because I'm introing it again. It's your boy Young mm-hmm. Lap, also uh, co-host Egg Platinum, the man himself. Howdy gamers. With a, with a story with, about his PC behind him, you know. Oh well, we'll get we'll get yeah, to that. And Let's... then also we got Tanner here as a, you know, he's just kind of vibing, being a dad. Mm-hmm. He's a, mm-hmm. uh, and then yep. also we have a, a special guest, uh, a, a, a homie. Uh, uh, would you like to introduce Ozzie. yourself, man? Yeah. <laughs> uh, hey. Austin really knows him. I've met him a couple of times and shit. He's pretty cool. So you know, fucking let's. We got any, any yeah we actually uh worked worked together is how we uh how we met both working at radio shack i'm sorry <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, you had to be alone with austin he just yeah, i can yeah. only imagine the shit, that he, the, the shit that he sends us on snapchat where he just goes on like a 10 minute rant or some shit that's just him all day it's just him just mm-hmm. like <laughs> Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We're freaking mad. <laughs> yeah, I actually uh, related to that. I had a lady yesterday, fucking boomer, of course, comes in, and uh, after she asked me whatever it was, she goes, so "Where are all these illegals at?" I'm like, said- "What? <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> God, like, what? Damn! I, I, honestly, I was like, huh?" Hang on a second. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> what did you just say? That's like funny. I saw a bus the other day. I'm like, you're making, you're not, you're not making it any better. Stop. <laughs> you know what's funny? Because for for those of you who don't know, uh, where we're at, we the businesses have to during the summer hire a bunch of foreign exchange students to staff the uh the different amusement parks Mm -hmm. and uh that's that's who she was referring to bro that shit's people are and then it got creepy well i mean obviously because she she started asking like if i knew specifically where they lived i'm like no if you specifically know (laughs) (laughs) if i if i know where exactly like their address yeah like, dude i got you uh, just, it's, no <laughs> yeah. you know i got you hang on let me write it down <laughs> one place where they all go <laughs> yeah, they're say. all yep. there <laughs> it's like they just spawn they're there it's like there. cyberpunk fucking 2077 <laughs> you turn around you look around the fucking corner just oh boom npcs just at the fucking ass <laughs> <laughs> That game was so <laughs> fucked on launch. Holy shit! I think we talked about that it's on the still podcast. Bugged? Yeah. No, it's actually gone it's like still, pretty much better. It's still a bit bugged, but not anywhere close to what it was. It's actually playable now. Yeah. So, <laughs> I, I, it's not a great game, but it's a game. It's. Yep. <laughs> yep. It's a game. That's for sure. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> dude <laughs> speaking of games though there's some shit that i saw recently that has me a little bit excited i don't know if you guys yeah. know this about me or not but i'm a huge fan of the ninja gaiden series and stuff and mm-hmm. uh i there was a, a just a bandai uh toho's fucking sale on steam recently and they fucking showed there the fucking master uh sorry master chief collection uh the fucking uh ninja gaiden fucking remasters and shit and fucking for pc and stuff i'm like oh shit you already know your boy's gonna play that shit on stream <laughs> i love those hell yeah. games and they're fucking hard as hell uh i've only beaten like one a couple of times and two's pretty fucking rough if you want to get s rank but this shit has me hype i uh I, I I have a I have a few games that I I would love to play, but uh, 
<laughs> my baby here. She um, well, well, she's, she's dead in pain right, now. right now. Well, she's actually she's physically dead lot. right now. Like <laughs> I, I have it plugged in. Power switch on. You can see the lights on the motherboard. But yeah, that ain't turning on. Nothing. <laughs> so, uh, as you guys last last podcast, at the end of it, my computer just sort of crashed. <laughs> Well, that that's that's when it happened. <laughs> yeah. Um, I at first thought it was the RAM, and uh, so I, I took the RAM out and I stuck it in my streaming PC because they both run Ryzen processors, and uh, it uh, I, I ran a a memory test program called uh, MemTest. Oh, you ran a MemTest, and yeah. uh, it spit up. Yeah, it uh, it spit out a bunch of errors. So I'm like, oh yeah, it's the RAM for sure. And then uh, <laughs> I ordered a new a, a new kit of RAM. I, I decided to buy two 16 gig sticks. Jeez, man, bro, you already had the sticks that were from this old one. What? Oh, you mean this this <laughs> yeah. one? Yeah, yeah, that one. <laughs> because uh, I later on found out that it wasn't actually the ram because i just booted the windows normally because what ended up happening is anytime that anything windows related started loading immediately boot blue screen even when i booted to a windows 10 install media it would do the same thing um so I just went on and I, I swapped out parts until I found out I, I narrowed it down. It either had to be the processor or the motherboard. I thought it was going to be the motherboard. I honestly but, thought uh, that's what it was going to be too, but oof. yeah, that's I've had issues. I've had too. issues with my motherboard in the past, but it was actually the processor. Hey, awesome! I stuck this my. Is... Uh, all this gives you yeah. is a new avenue to buy an upgrade. Just get the nice new processor. That's exactly what I did. Hey, I, hell, yesterday, yeah. I uh, I ordered a Ryzen 7 5800X on Amazon. It's coming in on Monday. Now you can't and, complain uh, about Valorant at all. At least you fucking shouldn't. Well, I... No, <laughs> no, no, no. No. I, so... <laughs> so... um. Actually, no, that wasn't the end of the stream or the end of the podcast wasn't when it died. I was in the middle of a game of Valorant. Yeah, I was there. And I just <laughs> I just couldn't I couldn't get back in. So we um I I was like, well, what the fuck can I do? I want to get back into the game. I don't want to just abandon my teammates. So I just downloaded it on my streaming PC and <laughs> logged in and booted it all up. In the middle of their game. <laughs> yeah, he didn't come back to the like, game the out, turned half. off to the side. Yeah. Playing on this this Logitech mouse rather than my nice wireless gaming <laughs> make gaming mouse and playing on this yeah, the plain gamer old keyboard. wireless keyboard. <laughs> the gamer board. <laughs> turned off to the side. Hell yeah. I, it was not it was not pleasant. <laughs> We lost, by the way, but we almost won, <laughs> which, you know, is kind of surprising. We actually did pretty well. Um, mm -hmm. But, oh, yeah. yeah, that was, it's really funny. We had four teammates the entire game. <laughs> yeah, but speaking of PCs, uh, Ozzy, I hear you're a, a fan of some PCs. I don't know why I yeah. said it like that. But, <laughs> I don't know either. Uh, we, we talked You're about a, this before. You like fans yeah, and yeah, PCs. Mm, yes, fans. Yes. <laughs> Hot. Uh, uh, well, I've talked about this with Austin before, and I've said what I've gotten and shit. But, like, what's your dream PC and shit? Like, if you had, like, just could throw shit, just whatever fucking in there. What case and shit would you go in with? Uh, um, that's a... That's a hard question to just pull I out mean, of my ass. True. Well, I mean, get to listen, bitch. Yeah, true. <laughs> uh, I mean, uh, it doesn't make sense to go with Intel, well, so I'd probably go with AMD. Okay, hold on, hold on. Stop what you're saying. We'll let you think a little bit. 
Yeah, Tanner, give us a raise energy ad read. Um, it's an energy drink that you drink, and um, it's pretty all right. Hey, whoa, it's it. great. Hey, you, Tanner, you <laughs> love it. Like, I'm just going to say this right now. If you would, I'm going to buy you some cans, you know, ship them to your house to be COVID safe. You know, I don't want to risk anything. Just you're infected over um, there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll definitely drink all of them and give them a great review. Yeah, I know I, what you could do, Tanner. Tanner, yeah. give it to AJ. Do, well, let's not do that. Let's, no, let's energy. not do that. <laughs> oh. Also, do not, do yeah. not consume it if you're under the age of seventeen. Coin. I think it is. Sure, maybe it's eighteen. Yep, one know. of those. Um, <laughs> Whatever. Read it on the on the website. Yeah. Use code small member for fifteen percent off at checkout. Tanner, you're pretty good at these ad reads. <laughs> I'm gonna... I know. I'm, I'm born at it. Yeah, I'm just waiting for my Bud Light Seltzer sponsorship. Oh, well, you're gonna be waiting a fucking <laughs> while, man. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna need to get to like episode five hundred before we get like. Anywhere close to some shit like that. I'm hoping for I'll at take, some point you know, like a butt plug sponsorship, like one that like whistles Adam or some Eve. shit. Yeah. Hell yeah. So just ship. I just have a dildo stuck you know up what on I the would fucking do if wall I had behind that? me. Just, just you I would have just to censor it for up. YouTube, but I would just throw a bunch of them into just like a unlabeled cardboard box and just leave it outside of my friend's house. Austin, what happens if your fucking mom just, oh my god, imagine if we got a sponsorship like that, and it goes to Austin's house, like, Austin's the one talking to him and shit, so he gets the shit delivered, his fucking parents open up the fucking package, it's just full of dildos, pocket pussies, just the fucking most fucked up shit, does Austin get kicked out at that point, is that like, that when it's like, he's now explaining it, that's, that's when they know that I've made it. <laughs> That's when they know. Hell yeah, gamer. Holy shit, dude. That's really fucking <laughs> funny, I'll be honest. Oh. Uh, Hell yeah. Yeah. Anyway, do you got any ideas now? Give them to me, so. Yeah, so, uh, uh, like I said, AMD for sure. Ryzen 9 probably. If I just had unlimited money. Yeah, go for it. I'd want something with a really high thread count because I do a lot of video editing. Red Ripper. Uh, That's, yeah. <laughs> That's what Austin went with. Red Austin Ripper. With a thread ripper. Yep. Yeah, unlimited money yeah, as well. Yeah, for the video edit. So when I when I decided to upgrade to my the fifty eight hundred X, I I was seriously considering getting a Ryzen five instead. But then I thought I'm like, I do I edit the podcast and I I want to do more editing when I get done with school and shit. I mean, shit. well, think about this also. So, You're gonna have to edit the Pound the Town processor. video this, this summer. Oh, yeah. So, no, <laughs> need to oh, yeah. Also, Ozzy, in case you didn't know this, there is a Pound Town, Wisconsin. Yeah. <laughs> it's up oh. north. <laughs> Wait, really? <laughs> yeah, it's like two yeah. hours north from us. If I look it up right now, you're not... You're not shitting Yeah, me. look up Pound Town, comma, WI, and it'll pop up. I don't know if I should go into incognito mode for this or not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's just There's a small three shit churches, town. two bars. Yeah, it's just a, a real public shit park. Hole. But <laughs> There's not gonna, a school, though. We're gonna fucking go <laughs> there. There's a lot more churches. <laughs> I, uh, I, it's so funny that you're right yeah <laughs> it's just some fucking shithole we've done gonna, our research on pound town all right we're gonna go there and do a fucking review on it or some shit i don't know we're gonna just go fuck around or some shit up there and it's gonna be fucking fun <laughs> yeah i'm gonna bring my nice dslr camera and also my nice gimbal and uh we're gonna film some videos up there we're gonna Imagine, like, the locals, like, just looking <laughs> outside their house and, like, 20-some-year-old guys just running around with cameras. I like the idea that we still juvenile. get... I still like the idea that we get a tandem bicycle. We just fucking... <laughs> I've, I've tried riding one of those. I can't. No? <laughs> I, I think it'd be Seth and... <laughs> Okay. It's impossible. Also... 
Also, so what what Zach was referencing there uh, a couple of weeks ago, we were just sort of chilling, uh, walking around the the town where Tanner lives. Walked up to a a, a train museum. Was it? Or was it a train <laughs> station? Yeah, One of the two. train museum. Yeah, and uh, you know, a few cars passed. We go, okay, let's go walk over to the this other place. We we walk all the way over there, and then we're, we got done over there. We're like, okay, let's just go home now. So we're walking home, and we got like half a block from where Tanner lives, and two squad cars pull up and they're like, hey, we had some calls about you guys, and we're like, no, we're no, we're just chilling. Yeah. <laughs> and then they uh, the next cool. morning we got we got tagged on the uh, Facebook scanner page for a bunch of. To uh, juveniles walking around in the dark. <laughs> yeah, the first thing they asked us was their age, and we're all like 22, 22, 23, 18. Oh, okay. <laughs> we're just some yeah, yeah, they're called later. juveniles. Yeah. And we, didn't really, we didn't do anything. No, oh, <laughs> we just no, we're walking still around. On the road, so it's, yeah. That is whack. I was offended. Anyway, anyway, have no it, chill, it, man. All of the newest shit, right? So that's pretty standard. You guys don't know all that. <laughs> well, water cooled, of well, course. When you say newest, but shit, I would cool. want it to be small. I would want would it to be small. Do you go like Nvidia times. or AMD? No, Nvidia. Yeah. Nvidia. I'm just. Still? I, I I have nothing against AMD. I just I'm used to Nvidia. They're better mm -hmm. for but graphics cards right now. So. The better yeah. Choice. Well, if you if you pair the uh, third gen Ryzen with the you know highest end card and put on their overclock thing, it actually does outperform the uh, thirty ninety. Really? Mm -hmm. With like mm -hmm. the fucking. I, uh, I, I, I knew there... a dude that in that when I worked at Ironside, this dude was the biggest motherfucking AMD fanboy. I've ever fucking met in my life. <laughs> like, he was just AMD fucking dick sucker number one. Just always fucking being like, yeah, back, check this back, shit out. Gets one of them RX <laughs> graphics cards. Yeah, he did, yeah, he got the fucking... Or I, no, what was it? No, the R, R9 or R7, what Tanner it, has. It was, it, <laughs> he mm -hmm. got one of the fucking like, <laughs> high-end ones and, or, or whatever. And I'm like, dog, why? <laughs> Why'd you do this to yourself? <laughs> <laughs> but he was, like, one of the first people to get me on the wave of, like, uh, I think it was the 3 Series or, like, shit. Well, those were some bomb-ass CPUs. <laughs> oh, yeah, the cheap. FX Series. Yeah. 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 Hell yeah, respect. So what, what are you all yeah, rocking I, I would... right now? Uh, well, Tanner my... has the, uh... The oldest PC. Do you remember what you mm -hmm. got in yours, Tanner? Uh, all I remember is my graphics card is a 290X. I think he has oh. like one of the like the last APU. generation of shitty AMD CPUs. Yeah. Like right before they switched to Ryzen. Mm -hmm. And it's an APU so that I was going to be able to crossfire and I never took the time to do it. And I got a hard drive. I have a C or SSD in it now, but I still haven't done anything with it. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's about it. Stock cooler. Uh, <laughs> Doesn't yeah, really use it too often, I don't believe. No, not at all. I'm on my laptop right now. Well, okay. We also got to talk about Ian's PC. <laughs> uh, his bunk, too. Dude, what, it's why, like, what's up with Ian, Ian's PC? Ian's rocking some, like, he has like an Intel integrated graphics PC. Ooh, yeah. that is not okay. Yeah, <laughs> I used to have a pretty bitchin' PC no. until the CPU and motherboard died. That's what I figured out. It was both of them, so I just have to switch out both of them. Well, I'm just uh, lazy and don't want to upgrade any shit. I have other shit to do, but. For a while, I was rocking two 1080s with a 9700K. 
An SLI? Oh, uh, yeah. The fucking brute. Interesting. Yeah, when he was, when he, when the There's employees a... at Ironside get a really <laughs> fucking good discount on parts. Yeah, that's where I picked him up at. I was, I was like, hey, Bobby. <laughs> Like, <laughs> I have a, so one of my, one of my coworkers that we want to get on the podcast at some point, Lennon, he, uh, picked up a 3070 for like $430. Was it because it was our mayor or some shit? No, no. Brand Wait, new. Interesting. That's fucking lit though. Yeah. That's what I liked about working mm -hmm. at there. So I was like, I picked up. Yeah, now they're going for 1200 now they're in Texas. They are in Texas now, which is a big F. But I would never do that work again. <laughs> hey, look, the the owner is an asshole. The owner, well, he's not an. He is, but he's also the weirdest motherfucker I've ever met in my goddamn life. This dude straight yeah, up man, doesn't believe dinosaurs. Don't like just didn't exist. Like just straight up. What? Oh what? yeah, he's. <laughs> He's a, a really big religion dude. Yeah. He moved... The dinosaurs just didn't happen. No, he also moved to fucking, uh... The, uh a town uh, in Wisconsin because God told him to. Like, that's where you have yeah. to build a PC. He, he, yeah, he he's originally from... Um, Vegas and shit. Yeah, I, was, I, I couldn't remember the name. I'm just like, really big gambling town in Nevada. <laughs> <laughs> uh, mm, Reno. Uh, 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 fuck. <laughs> and and he's like, mm, I'm gonna set up in this town because God told me to. <laughs> uh <-huh>. <laughs> <laughs> Just yeah. bumfuck nowhere, Wisconsin. <laughs> this is the place to build PCs. <laughs> this is it. And now he's in Texas. <laughs> <laughs> God changed his mind. Yeah. <laughs> God said he didn't like winter. I agree with him. <laughs> no, it wasn't as bad this year, I'll be honest. It was mm -hmm. pretty pretty tame. I like the year where it got down to negative fifty. <laughs> My car barely Ooh. started. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That was the best. Five minutes and you had frostbite? Mm -hmm. Oh boy. Yeah. I had to. I pissed I, outside I day, real I quick. To... I was just like, I was risking it. I was like, either I get caught <laughs> I had frostbite to, or I uh, call. I had to call the police station and be like, hey, I can't move my car. Please don't give me a ticket. <laughs> and they, they didn't give me a ticket. <laughs> My car literally won't start. <laughs> oh, that would have been funny if they lol, get fucked. <laughs> yeah, that would have been funny if they were just like, nah, get fucked, pussy. <laughs> they specifically <laughs> drive to your fucking house and like, oh, this fucking idiot gave us the fucking... <laughs> <laughs> Alright, <laughs> bet. <laughs> Easy money. Uh, I, I, I have to make sure that I... Because we have alternate parking. I have to make sure that I park on the right side of the street because I'm pretty... My my mom last year called out the the police on, over Facebook. And, uh, yeah, they every single time that I don't move over, they, they always ticket me 100% of the time. <laughs> Oh, damn. By alternate parking, you mean there's uh, different rules depending on the time of day. Yes. Yeah. So during the during the winter, because like plows and shit, on even number days at when it's when it's at when it's two a.m. on even number days, you have to park on the even side of the street. The, what does the like, even odd, side uh, of the street mean? So what does that mean? So, like, like my house number is is well, don't two say five it. three. Oh. Yeah, I didn't actually say it. I just threw out a number. Okay. Um, that's an odd number. That three. So well, yeah, on odd number days, I have to park on the same size street as where I live. I mean, yeah, I think it's. I mean, I get it. I think it goes on a little too long, but I. I mean, mm -hmm. I understand. 
And that's uh, exactly what my my mom started beef about because it was like April and there was it was like 70 degrees and there's still alternate alternate parking. And my mom was like, my mom was like, why is there no, you know, why is there still alternate parking if there's no snow? And then and then they responded. They're like, uh, for the for the street cleaners. And my mom's like, in the last eight years that we've lived here, not once has a street cleaner come down our street. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that's what I'm saying. I don't think I've it. ever seen that shit. Yeah, Austin's now just just like, all right, motherfuckers, here we go. <laughs> Yeah, I give. I give. I was gonna say they wait till two a.m. and they're just straight up like (laughs) hit you guys first. Just fuck them. One fifty-eight. One fifty-eight. I got a ticket. Running to his car. (laughs) I got a ticket like a week and a half ago. Oh really? They've stopped caring about alternate parking here. <laughs> yeah, no, nope. a month nope. ago. <laughs> no. well, that's because got, Austin's got two targeted. Tickets. Austin's two fucking. <laughs> Austin's mom started the beef, and now he's cro- started the fucking crossfire because yeah, she's he lives like, in... she gets to park in the fucking driveway. Hey. Austin's targeted. <laughs> yeah, true. it's funny because I, uh, I, it's it's funny. I go down the street and like you know down to the at the end of the road, a T intersection. And uh, I turn left to go to work, and <laughs> when I get down there, there's no tickets on any of the cars. Hmm. <laughs> it's just me. It's one, d- it, it's one dude or some shit that's just like, <laughs> motherfucker made me look fucking it's stupid. It's only when Officer <laughs> Carl is on duty. Motherfucker made me look dumb. I'm gonna shut this motherfucker. <laughs> 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 He's oh, the one that dude. runs the social media overnight. <laughs> <laughs> Waiting every day. He's yeah. on the right side this time. All right. Uh, <laughs> piece of shit. <laughs> I really like when people use electric vehicles. Yeah. Like electric bikes and stuff, because there's not a lot of lot of laws around them. That's true. So when when you <laughs> go on the street. With like an electric skateboard or electric scooter or something, the cops look, look at you kind of funny. They're like, "What the fuck?" <laughs> They're confused. They're like, "Huh?" You know, something's kind of weird. Huh. So Wisconsin, Wisconsin law, right? If you have a two-wheeled vehicle that is, uh, a, like a you know actually motorized licensed vehicle, uh, a moped, like I have one. It has to be 49 cc or below, or you have to have a motorcycle's mm-hmm. license. But if you attach a motor to a bicycle, you can have up to 149 cc. Ah. <laughs> Loopholes. Like before you have to before you have to have a, a motorcycle license. It specifically says that, like in paragraph one, is how the fuck are you gonna get a motorcycle CC. license if you drive around a fucking bike with a motor? <laughs> that you the saddest motherfucker. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I drive a fucking bike. <laughs> you should just say your moped's a modified bike. <laughs> no, that's not how it works. <laughs> Let's it's fucking soup bike, that baby yeah, up. Yeah. Rice it out. <laughs> in a straight pipe hit my god no please Dude, I've those been things on... are really loud already they do not be straight, straight, pipe, straight pipe. Pipe. You're forward. it's only Focus. two strokes you just <laughs> you hit the gas and you just Dude. how'd you know my nickname <laughs> two strokes two strokes <laughs> <laughs> Actually, <laughs> speaking of that, something I've wanted to bring up for a hot while, and you know, you're gonna like be our first. Going. You're our first guest uh, that I'm gonna ask this question to, and you know, feel free to ask one of us because I don't think any of us have ever said any stories like this on the podcast. But uh, do you have any funny masturbation stories or anything? Any like getting caught or like just doing something wacky? No, not no? really. Mm. Uh, dude, I got one. Kind of sus. Yeah, I like never like <laughs> jerked off like 
while there was like someone like in the next no room or some shit. shit or like with the risk of them walking in just like quickly to fucking Danny yeah, you've done that right <laughs> yeah I've been caught by my sister one time cause like I wasn't doing nothing and I she came into my room and was like hey talk to dad so I talked to my dad on the phone and then she left and I was like alright it's time to get down to business wait and while you're talking to the door your dad no, afterwards. Okay. <laughs> and then I was getting down to business before I even started, and I look over, and she just... <laughs> she, she didn't, like, leave the hallway. <laughs> and I was like... Mm-hmm. Uh, okay, yeah. yeah. No, I've never, I've never had anything like that, but this one time I uh, was uh, up at uh, Cabin Deer Hunting way up north, <laughs> uh, with my dad and my grandfather, <laughs> and uh, and I was uh, you know doing my thing in the bathroom. <laughs> well, then my yeah. well, then my grandpa really had to take a crab. <laughs> oh was... <laughs> fuck! Yeah, that's fucking funny. <laughs> uh, and I was like so far into it, I didn't care at that point. <laughs> just like, dude, wait, man. <laughs> dude, sometimes you just need to fucking yeah, finish fuck it out. Dude. I agree with it, dude. Fucking grandpa, sorry, man. You have to fucking wait. Oh, I my. came out, he was like holding his ass and like nearly knocked me over running inside the bathroom. It was fantastic. That's mad funny. Yeah, I got a I got a good Austin, you got any? Um I, I'm pretty sure I've talked about it in the past during the podcast, but yeah, I've had my uh, my sister and my mom walk in on me multiple times. <laughs> That's not <laughs> multiple times. <laughs> yeah, yeah they just, multiple times. Austin they just, just beat this dick so have... many times. Here, just... let me let me let me shed some light. Real quick. He's just fucking uh, beating this dick so... so much. He's risking it. I uh, yeah. Spin my camera around here. Wow, wow, look at this. You can see I have just a curtain for my door. Hey, for the audio listeners, so, yeah, he has a, just a curtain there. It's, it's a curtain. And the audio listeners. Okay, well, true. And people just uh, do not knock. <laughs> That's kind of Well, fun. how do you knock on a curtain? That is true. Yeah. On the you don't. Wall. You knock on the, the wall next to it. Casey does it. Evan does it. <laughs> Oh yeah, because they have Nobody a dick to jerk off, so they, they come Have they me. ever caught you? <laughs> have your brother has ever fucked you? Just get a button no, on the wall no. that plays a knocking sound. Austin <laughs> was too quick. I was actually moments. thinking about um at, at Radio Shack, we have some really uh we have a shitty brand, that, uh like <laughs> it's called Starin, and uh they uh they have a doorbell. <laughs> oh, Starin. <no. laughs> So yeah. I could get a doorbell, uh, and it's battery powered, where it's just a couple of double A's and it has some adhesive, and I could just stick it right here. <laughs> you should like get a piece of paper too to like point to the fucking arrow, just feel like, <laughs> hey, busy, ring this. Just have a silence as I may be jerking off. Enter your <laughs> the, own room. The oh only my god! Thing that stops me from doing it is that. I feel like Flash would just freak out any time that anyone hit the button. That would be so fucking <laughs> funny. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> and the best thing about staring stuff is because my our, our discount is that we pay just 5% over cost. Mm-hmm. And uh, Starin just had a whole bunch of... Uh, they, had, they closed a warehouse. So they just... They did a oh, clearance sale. My... God, that order was the most ridiculous experience of my life. So there was we an we have semi. a small mom and pop shop, and a fucking eighteen wheeler semi rolls up and unloads. I think it was like sixteen pallets, Hell and yeah. it lines up and blocks out half of the store. <laughs> we we it took us like. Two and a half weeks to check it all in. That's the wild. System. It took us months at the other one. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> and, uh, but because of that, I can get a whole bunch of stuff for extremely cheap. Like, oh, yeah. I have a 50, or no, a 32-foot HDMI cable for $2. 4K 
HDMI cable. <laughs> for $2. Dude, nice. Hell yeah. But anyway, back to masturbation. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Tanner, I just want you to say that's pretty hot what you're doing over there. <laughs> I'm I'm talking, I've, I've talking about noticed masturbation it. right now. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's how I'm making it. Yeah, he's yeah. he's just doing it right now. Okay, um, <laughs> a great a great story. Yeah, we can't see his That's hands. That's why we can't see life. his hands. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! We're gonna have to just off camera. Right, that anyway. camera's getting kind of shaky there. <laughs> it is dogs just by him, bro. It's crazy. Um. Anyway. No. <laughs> At, at some point in like middle school i had to become the fastest uh just, i had to become the fastest jerker off in the west because <laughs> jesus christ because i had two brothers and shit and it wasn't straight face yeah, while doing that. it was i had two brothers and sh- jesus fucking christ i was respectful during your story tanner you piece of shit for audio <laughs> listeners he's just shaking his laptop <laughs> Uh, he was like actually, he's trying to no, he was like he's actually trying to give just a baby shaking nope. baby syndrome Anson was actually just below cam. And was, I'm just joking. That's fucked up. Really anyway. dark analogy. <laughs> I became the fastest at it. I could, just, came to my mind. I could just jerk off super quick. Like, I, I would Fast like. Jerk off in the West. Yeah, but it came at a cost. It came at the oh cost of I would cramp my legs because I would tense my entire body. I would essentially, like, go, like, full, like, Super Saiyan. I'd be like, oh! And I could just fucking like, come in 30 seconds. Just lights on fire. Just yeah. blue flames all around him. But there were a lot of times that I would, if I did it too much, I would get a cramp in my legs and shit. And then I would fucking be like, oh! I just dying make it nut harder yeah it, dude yeah it dude some of those were the best <laughs> holes in the ceiling imagine <laughs> almost as good as someone the, to a duel. actually an, another funny <laughs> you, sex you story take, i don't remember if i ever told you turn them. around <laughs> okay you go you turn around you take five paces and then you and then you, you turn and then so you can jerk off the, fr- the fastest <laughs> just one guy just one stroke and he's nuts and he's like yeah i'm the best one guy turns around and doesn't even have to stroke, he just fucking nuts. Uh, you can do it telepathically. <laughs> Rob makes eye contact and just, <laughs> Fucking telepathically nuts, just. <laughs> the guy turns around, the guy, they turn around, the nuts already on the other guy's face. <laughs> Jesus Christ, he can do it from, like, just that, he's that fucking volatile. <laughs> For just turning around, he can fucking just spray it that far. He, we're talking five fucking like paces. Like, Imagine mm-hmm. being praised for being a one pump chump. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine. Imagine it gets. To, it, it's an Olympic sport. Dude, actually, you know what's funny? Is there's an event hosted in like Boston or some shit called like the 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 smallest dick contest. And they have dudes there that <laughs> just show their small cocks and shit off. And I'm like, that's that's fucking hilarious. There's like you can win a trophy too for to smallest cock and shit. <laughs> yeah. That'd be a bitter bittersweet moment. I, it's <laughs> you get a plaque for it. You do, yeah. <laughs> smallest you bring some chick home <laughs> and you have a hey, baby on display. <laughs> Check out this is my awards closet. Austin, Austin <laughs> think about this though. Dick, bowling second place, bowling third place, bowling fourth place. Austin, think about this though. You could put that next to your virginity rocks poster. Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just, that can make sense. <laughs> you just see how, like, Austin, have you had a girl in your bedroom since you put that flag up? No. Since I put the flag up, no. Austin hasn't had a girl in his bed since oh, eight. How about before? No. Before? Yeah. Okay. Ooh. Ooh Austin's mm-hmm. uh, getting a little spicy. But I got a funny story. I don't know if I've ever said it on the podcast or not. But one time, uh, I, I know you, Tanner and you know this, uh, the, the story of, I'm not gonna come. Uh, 
And so, <laughs> so, come, I'm not gonna come. <laughs> yeah. so I was with this chick at the time and uh, we, we, we did the, the sex a lot. I'm not going to brag. You know, I'm pretty good at it. <laughs> I'm we did the best sex. I'm not going to brag. She needs to brag. <laughs> I'm not going to brag anything. Uh, no, but uh, that's, the sex we that's had a cap. lot. That's cap. Well, that was a true fact. Uh, but I'm just going to ignore that for now. This one time, we were just fucking going at it. And I, for whatever reason... She's just like, oh, just don't come. And from that point, I'm like, oh, I'm not going to come. I'm not going to come. I proceeded to just bust two fat loads just back to back. Like I was just fucking KO'd. Just, oh. <laughs> I'm, just like, I'm dying. Have you guys ever heard of the uh, Canadian parking meter? What the no. fuck? No. <laughs> So a Canadian parking meter is a uh, is a sexual move, where <laughs> where you uh but you go and get a hooker right, but before you get this hooker, you got to get some supplies first. You need rolls of quarters in which you plan to pay this woman. And you need a bottle of maple syrup. And you need to make sure the bottle is plastic. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so. When you bring her to the hotel room or whatever you're doing, you're doing her from behind, right? <laughs> Knock know, her out. <laughs> <reminds me> of... <laughs> and then you take you take the bottle of maple syrup, you unscrew the cap, stick it in her ass, <laughs> and just empty the whole thing. Just <laughs> yes. <laughs> and then. This is why you need to make sure the, the bottle is plastic. You need to cut it in half now. And you use it as a funnel to funnel the quarters to in put there. Put the coins in, yeah. <laughs> That's a Canadian parking meter. Then when she That's... wakes up in the morning and goes to the bathroom, she gets paid. Mm -hmm. But it's very sticky. That's, <laughs> That's mad fucking funny. I might have to give that a try. Okay, buddy. <laughs> Actually... Dude, have you? I don't know if you guys have heard uh, the the situation. Do you guys know who EDP forty five is? Oh yeah, no. Mm -mm. E eat that no. pussy forty five. He's some fucking yep. YouTuber or some shit who recently got caught messaging like some thirteen year olds or some shit. And like trying this, to meet up with her. Yeah, and oh my shit. God. Uh, but I don't know if you Tanner. I don't know if you saw the messages or not. He went for a cupcake. Oh, yeah, well, like, that, but no, 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 I I'm talking about, messages. okay, uh, so I was watching, um, Critical did a great video, you guys should definitely check that shit out, of, like, documenting the whole thing and going through both of them, like, going through the text messages and shit, and going through, like, the other thing, um, but anyway, it, in some of the text messages and stuff, like, pretty early on, like, to the fucking, when he's talking to this fucking person, he sends a picture of his shit. Like, he's just like, nothing just got done taking a huge shit, and then just proceeds to fucking <laughs> send a picture of his fucking toilet to yeah. this fucking person. Just fuck? unfiltered or and whatever. This guy's a fat, fat man, too. Oh, he's a fucking huge man, yeah. <clears throat> so shit you know what small. I've been watching recently on YouTube? Oh. It's like, when I'm bored at work, um, a lot of Cinnamon Toast Ken, like, reaction videos, like, Dr. Phil and shit. Yeah, and like uh, they doctor. did a they did a reaction to of a uh, to catch a predator. That show's great. I lo <laughs> I've watched I like I I think it was like a couple of years ago or some shit. I literally watched like all the episodes and shit. Our highlights of the best moments and shit. Yeah, I did two on YouTube. I, yeah, yeah. yeah. One after another, dude. The one what? with the dude okay, walks so naked. For those of you who don't know what it is. They had oh, yeah. basically they had a bunch of people go out to and catfish a bunch of predators in like, in like a certain area. To, they would to, do it in like certain uh, areas for each season and shit. Yeah, and like would lure and uh, they they would convince these people that they were you know a, a fourteen or you know some underage girl, and then Sometimes tell them to go boy. to this house. And they go into the house, and then uh, some usually some decoy ladies there, and he's like, "Okay, just sit down at the table over there, and uh, she, I'll, I'll be right back out." And she'd carry like a laundry basket or something into the back room, 
And then Chris Hansen would walk out and be like, he's "Oh, like, how's hey, it going?" Why don't you take a seat right over there <laughs> and just have an interview with him? Yeah, he's like, "Do you do you know what you've said? <laughs> like, this is some pretty fucked up <laughs> shit." He's like, "We start reading the messages and shit too." You know, she's thirteen and she just go in <laughs> on him and stuff. It's true. It, one and of like, my yeah, yeah. It, and try to figure out like why they did it. Okay, mm-hmm. and then yeah. they just arrest them. Uh huh. Yeah, and then when they wait, they're like, "All right, so I'm well, good to no, go, no. right?" My, and then he's like, "Yeah, you're free to part. leave this house." <laughs> like, yeah, <laughs> and then they walk outside, and a bunch of cops squat uh, swat them basically. <laughs> <laughs> and go, it's, no, yeah, get out the ground, get out the it, ground. It, they're, always like, they're always Dude, like, "They're always like, 'Dude, I'm so episode. sorry, said, I'm so sorry.'" I, I remember one episode. Two, the host hey, guy Chris, hey, knew the guy. Oh yeah, because he, he got caught before time. or some shit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what? There, there's he, he a knew the guy. He's like, "Hey, I know you." They had seen each other and shit on the train <laughs> and stuff. So. And then when Chris came out, the guy was like, "Holy oh, shit!" and just fucking dipped. Yeah. <laughs> that show is fucking. I, uh, it's kind of yeah, it's kind of nuts. So I think they said like at at the end of like the the season, they they talked about how many people they got. I think they said they got some some ridiculous number, like fifteen or seventeen, over the course of a week and a half. Yeah. Gosh. I I always liked with That's that uh, crazy. No, that yeah, that is yeah true. Uh, actually, speaking mm-hmm. of this, uh, okay, you guys know the whole fucking uh Jared Fogel situation, or right? You know, subway and nope. shit. You know, Austin. No, know. Do you guys know the Austin Jones situation at all? I don't know if you guys know that YouTube drama at all. Yeah. Okay, Dude, nope. I'll no. quickly go over this real quick for anyone that doesn't know it. Uh, Austin Jones, back in like 2000, fucking seven, 2008 or some shit, early YouTuber. He was just this fucking dude who like sang and shit. He just did a bunch of covers, got real famous doing that or whatever. Anyway, fast forward like a couple years later and stuff. Uh, it comes out that there's a bunch of fucking, like, underage chicks that were his fans and stuff that were coming out and they had videos of them being all like, oh, I'm 14 and here's my asshole and shit. I'm 14. I'm 14, Austin. They would specifically, like, say the age in the videos and shit because that's what he would fucking want and stuff. And it, th- this this had come out, like, uh, like, a shit ton of, like, a bunch of this fucking stuff had come out. And anyway, this dude gets, like, 15 years. Mm. <laughs> 15 years? Are you fucking kidding me? It needs to be death. Uh, yeah. It, it, it's fucking wild. Do you know how much Jared Fogel got? <laughs> the, the, the it was, like, only, like, 10 years, right? It was, like, 20 or some shit, which is, like, the maximum you can get for it. Uh, <clears throat> and so... At some point, these dudes are gonna fucking... Austin Jones, he'll get out in, like, 2027 or some shit. Like, that's... It's still kind of fucking far away, but it's it's fucked up. He'll be, like, 40 when he gets out. Uh, like, uh, that's wild. <sighs> mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't know. It, it, yeah, but everywhere he goes, people are gonna know. That's true. Yeah, I, I, was, I was thinking about this, too. He literally can't go and start another fucking career or anything. Oh, yeah. It's not like... Pogo gets released in 2029. Uh-huh. Yeah. So we got 14 years. Yep. It's even more fucked up because did you know that he actually, like, had sex with underage people and stuff? Mm-hmm. Like, he had met Oh, he had actually followed man. through. Yeah, yeah. He had followed through and shit. Yeah, Whoa. he paid for sex with minors and receiving child pornography. Oh, well, that's fun. we're investigating him for eight years. Oh, uh-huh. yeah, it's it's wild, and like it's crazy to think about that. At some point, those guys are. Just well, there's that get congressman him. now that is being like investigated for child trafficking. Jesus Christ, Florida. man! Yeah, I didn't see that. That's wild. Uh, I think it's like Adam Gates or something like that. Uh-huh, yeah. yeah, look into him. He's probably going to prison here soon, for, even though he's a congressman. I mean, Florida do be pretty wild, though. So, so I'm kind of curious, like, what happens in that situation? Like, how do they fill the seat? 
Do they just have like an emergency vote or some shit? I don't think so. Yeah. Funny thing is, they, they him and another guy paid the girls, but they used Venmo. And with Venmo, you, you got like, to see it. <laughs> they want it to be like a social media thing. So they just said, for a fun night or an exciting night. And they paid them <laughs> with uh, like the county's money because of the other guy who got caught worked for the county and had a co- county credit card and paid them through that. So they used oh tax and money. That's the dumbest way they could have fucking. What, I was it. just gonna say, what an idiot! Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, and then they described what the fuck they're doing. I mean, them. I'm not, I'm not advocating for these yeah. people, but like, if you're gonna do that, you gotta be fucking smarter than that. Uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. So like that's a say, pretty dumb <laughs> move. <laughs> hey, uh, Shit like where's that, this that weird me me What for? would happen if we remove the warning labels from everything for two years? Yeah, there Nothing would be so change. many there fucking. Are, I don't those know. Those labels dude. are there because somebody fucked up first. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. It's yep. like because some fucking idiot just was like, "Oh, it, you know, you know, it doesn't say or anything." Boy, boy, shove this down my throat. I, or, I, I, or think about the fucking famous like McDonald's coffee shit. You know, when they didn't have the fucking oh, yeah. the caution, caution hot. hot. Yeah, some fucking. Like, yeah, no, no shit. My my, my uh, coffee about, shit. I didn't. Hmm. What about Tide Pods? Does everyone remember that? Oh, yeah. oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. I still get insulted that, that, by internet by people like that. That was a phase that happened. What, yeah. did you did you try to eat a Tide Pod? No, it's because uh, I was arguing with this guy who's like maybe 10 years older than me. He's like, oh, go back to eating Tide Pods like the rest of your generation. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, I was younger than me. <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty funny. Matter of fact, they're delectable. They got I so bad like... they had to put that in like locked I... cases in stores. I remember yeah. that people shit. Yeah. Take them. Dude, that's funny. I... Them look so delicious. Right. One of the things I like doing every now and then when I feel like I want to have a little bit of drama in my life, I just go and I'll read Tanner's co- like what Tanner's commented on <laughs> on Facebook. Oh, yeah. Tanner will just get that into random ass me. arguments with people. <laughs> Yeah, the oh, guy ended yeah. up blocking me because he ins- tried to insult me. So I just took a really uh, uh, one of the worst times in his life and just rubbed it in his face again. And he blocked me. Damn. His girl cheated I on him. I wish that Robert would block you, dude. That guy's annoying. <laughs> yeah. There's a lot of people no, right? that, that would block me, but I, I like know. arguing. I don't... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Do be wild to uh, think about, huh? Yeah. Hey, so another another thing. Hey, Ozzy, I know you had uh, you had a few interesting things you were doing with PCs and and devices. What what happened with those, or what 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 did you do? Like, I remember at one point you wanted to do something with like a an iMac. Ooh. Some shit. Well, with the new iMac. Oh yeah. So that that project kind of fell through but what i was gonna do is i was uh i found out that you can get adapters to adapt an imac display to run off of hdmi just a normal hdmi source so i was like well if i hollow out an imac can i build a whole computer inside of it a a windows pc with that adapter and just have it all internalized and i actually had a pretty good plan for it i just uh don't you do it. I <laughs> want <laughs> the new iMac. But it's uh, it's actually a lot harder than I thought it was going to be because there's once you put the screen in, there's not a lot of room behind it. So you, yep. yeah, everything's super, super thin, so cooling is hard. Yeah. Really hard. Yeah. Have you guys seen the new ones? Uh, I haven't really paid too much attention to them because I, like, I saw I saw a bunch of issues with uh if you had an issue with the operating system reinstalling it is a pain in the ass oh i believe it <clears throat> it's so thin you can't even have a fucking 3.5 millimeter jack in the back of it. it has to be on the side 
Why is everyone <laughs> complaining about that? I hate that it was on the back on the on every yeah, other mic. I don't like that either. I don't, I, don't, I don't think I would like that it was on the back. Oh, no. Shit say, Let's go. Well, and then they have not only was that on the back, but all of your USB supply. ports, your power supply, you, everything. Mm -hmm. All of your yeah. I.O. was on the back of it. So you Are you talking about the Mac Mini? No, no the, like the, the iMac. So the yeah, Apple Mac ones. Tripping, yeah. Anyway. Give it to the new iMac. It looks like an iPad on a stand. <sighs> Alright, my bad. <laughs> Honestly, uh, I love the new design. Right a lot like of people it. don't like it, but I Oh, I like the, the square design. I do I like, like the, the square design. I like Which the headphone jack on the side more. Yeah. Yeah, makes more sense. Ethernet's on the <laughs> power su power supply at Brick. Hell yeah. Oh, that's yeah, actually... If you get a I, the first time though. I saw that was when I got the uh, Chromecast Ultra from Google. Mm -hmm. uh, that's a good idea. I thought that was kind of interesting, but it makes it a, a lot harder to hide the fucking thing. Yeah. Or, like, it blocks another outlet or some shit. Yeah, sure. And apparently it has room-filling speakers. Interesting. Well, did they finally put the speakers at the bottom of the thing? Mm -hmm. That's what that chin bar is for. Okay, yeah, because, like, on all their other models, they just... It's just a big sheet of metal. <laughs> so I don't, I don't know if any of you actually watched the event where they unveiled the the IMAX. I don't watch on any April twentieth. I just watched had, They had the uh, they had a full disassembly of it, just a, just oh, a breakdown yeah. of it. Oh, that's kind of neat. Pretty much the whole computer is just in that chin. The mm -hmm. rest is all so thin that it's just display. Yep. And used probably for like passive cooling. Yeah. No, that's that's fucking cool though. Yeah, I like how it looks. Oh, you I'm know something else that, that I I learned about recently. What? Um, the Xiaomi Black Shark Four, either four or five, has 120 watt charging. Really? Yeah. You guys that's... see the phone that you could plug two cables in at once? Mm -hmm. I did. Yeah. Yeah. There's a couple of those, I thought. Mm hmm I like the, the Black Shark games. is one of them. The folding phones? A lot of phones. the gaming phones that can. Fold it on my wiener. Oh, I don't know why you want to charge yeah. that fast. I just think that's <laughs> kind of crazy. We're all trying to get toward a wireless charging future, and then here comes this company like, God, you just plug two cables in. That's fine. Sure. Yeah, Dude, two cables. I like the shit in, like... Well, no, it's for the, like, attaching a fan. I like the shit in some Asian countries. Uh, you can just be in a room and have it charge your shit. Oh yeah, that's dope. Well, I, I saw can't, one. I can't that, wait for that. Yeah, that would be cool. I saw one fun. that you plug both of them in at the same time, and it would charge your phone quicker. That's Did so that. whack. What the fuck? That is whack. There's a Lenovo yeah, phone I... I showed off that did that because it had the bat the batteries split in half and two. Yes, I think that's, that's how it. most of them. Okay, yeah. no, let me stop this right now. Most phones, most of the flagship phones do that now. The iPhone, starting with the iPhone 10, Apple even does it to sort of tell you how long that's been around. They split the, the watts between two batteries to allow it to charge twice as fast. Yeah. So I'm kind of curious how it's it's uh, looks on the inside of the uh, Black Shark Four because it's 120 watt charging. So like I'm wondering if they split it between three batteries or something. Fast, bro. That'd be pretty fast, I don't know if it was bro. this phone or another phone, but I, I also saw one where it had a wireless charger that came with it that had two coils in it, so it could charge both batteries. Thank you. That's cool. That's kind of interesting. <clears throat> Dude, <clears throat> there comes a point where like technology is just gonna take over. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, our robot I what that's called. It yeah. hasn't it already. It's well, kind of yeah. Twenty forty. Fuck was that thing? What Blade Runner? No. <clears throat> um. I'm like. Uh, I what Are you thinking of a movie, a game? No, there's an idea that where technology will be much smarter than humans can ever be. No, the computers. Uh, yeah, I know what you're talking about. I forget what the uh, what the saying is. Yeah. 
No, fuck yeah, though. Holy Technology shit. be kind of nuts, though. Yeah, but I'm still <laughs> fucking stupid at the same time. <laughs> yep. Yeah, I, 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 right I can attest for that. Ozzy and I can both attest to that. Dude, my Google Home wants to be thrown through a fucking wall. Fucking hate that thing. Understandable. But you still have it? Yeah, I use it for white noise. And like once, a, it, sometimes I'll just stop in the middle of the night. Mm -hmm. And it fucking it's stupid. And then uh, I'll be changing my son's diaper and he likes listening to the song Shots. It gets him pumped up. Mm -hmm. And uh, I, I say, hey, Google, play Shots. And it'll take a minute. And I'm like, playing Shots by OMFAO. And then it'll just sit there for another minute. I was like, did you fucking hear me? Hmm. And start playing right after I said, did you fucking hear me? Yeah. Try factory resetting it. Oh, I've un yeah. I'm, I'm unplugged it. I've reconnected it. And then I've... Oh, re factory resetting it. Yeah, I did. On the on my phone, the app and all that. I did all that. Reset it up at my home. and hmm. I hate it. Yeah, true. Well, no, Alexa's the same fucking way. Fuck that thing. True. Yeah, they are pretty dumb. But anyway, yeah. why, is, yeah. why is Siri still a thing? Fuck Siri. Sure. <laughs> yep. I have, because Apple's I have, trying really hard. I, I have not used it ever since I've had an iPhone. Like, yeah. ever. I can't I wait for Google. Apple to switch their phones to USB C. Sure because be at this point, everything else that they have uses USB C. Yeah, the iPad Pros, the laptop. I'm one chip in the MacBook now. Or not the MacBook, the uh, iPad Pro. Really? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Damn. yeah, that was another thing they announced in the uh, April event. Is the yep, and it's Thunderbolt, chip, too. It's a USB-C. It's Thunderbolt. Or it's also a two-terabyte option now. Mm -hmm. That is actually pretty fucking nice. Yeah. They still haven't fixed their fucking mouse, but... Why do you need two terabytes on a tablet? <laughs> uh, because they're pushing the whole thing where it's a re it's a laptop replacement. It's a computer substitute. Mm. It's never gonna be that. <laughs> Maybe for like if somebody's no. a design person, they use the iPad Pro for drawing, and they want to save all and, that drawing. And almost nobody's like going to buy the two no terabyte way. option, but they have to do that in order to back up their claim that it can be a laptop replacement. Yeah. Yeah, that supports external drives now. Oh, that I do like that. I do like yeah. external. I like seeing more support. Yeah, that's why they have like, the Thunderbolt and M1 chip. Should be pretty cool. Yeah. All right. Like, uh, I just had an update for my PlayStation there that allows me to trans. It I it allows me to transfer games to an external hard drive. It doesn't let me yeah. play them off of the external off them. But it, Xbox, it's faster uh, than re-downloading it every time. No, oh, yeah. Sell my Xbox still. Anyway, let's wrap this shit up here. Hey, uh, yep. Yeah. If you guys like this episode, make sure to uh, you know check out the links down below. Because uh, that's where all our social medias are. If you want to shout out anything, Ozzy, you can. Yeah, I'm Superfish with a 3 instead of an E on pretty much everything, but I'm Tech Bloom on YouTube. Hell yeah, man. Thanks for coming out. Really do appreciate it. All right. Yeah. Thanks for having me. Hell yeah. Yeah. Bitches.